Hi all folks, this is Max from uh, GalaxyNexusRoot.com um, So I'm going to do an installation video um, for Paranoid Android ROM uh, which is available for all Galaxy Nexus, GSM, uh, Verizon and Sprint. Uh, first what you'll need to do is um, go ahead and download the appropriate uh, ROM file All right. Um, basically for GSM it's um, the file ending in Toro and oh, sorry, Maguro. All right, Maguro is a code name for GSM. For those of you who don't know, and for uh, for Verizon CDMA, it's uh, the file ending in Toro Plus. I'll have the links, but um, I just want to explain what these things mean. Toro Plus um, means um, Sprint, Galaxy Nexus. These are all like sushi names, um, if you've noticed. Anyway, and uh, for for Sprint, um, I just did. Uh, sorry. For Verizon is Toro, and uh, for Sprint is Toro Plus. So go ahead and uh, download the appropriate ROM files, and also there's a um, fix file. It works on all the all the phones. Um, that's the same, and also G apps, um, Google apps. If you don't flash that, you won't have um, Google apps. A lot of people ask me why I don't, why I don't have a, a Play Store, and uh, they didn't flash the Google apps. But I'll walk you through since. Um, Rather than answering all those questions, I can just point to this video. Um, so you, you've uh, downloaded the three files and copied it over. ROM file, the fix, and the G apps. All right. And once you, uh, you're done, um, we'll reboot into recovery. Um, you can uh, use the menu if you have a custom ROM. Or what you can do is um, just take the battery out, hold down volume up and volume down, and the power button. I'll show you the manual just in case for those of you who are on stock ROMs. This is a fail, fail proof uh, method. And then go down to recovery mode using the volume buttons. Hit the power button. This will enter you into um, clockwork mod recovery. Um, most likely. If you use my root methods at uh, Galaxy Nexus root, you will have a um, clockwork mod recovery. And here we're just simply going to do a wipe and install it. So let's go to uh, Wipe Data Factory and say yes. And this should take like five seconds. Um, once that's done, we're simply going to install the ROM file first. And if you know how to install these ROMs, don't even bother watching this video. <laughs> um, choose it from SD card, hit the power button. And go find um, the the files you copied over earlier. I put it in my download folder um, under my paranoid folder here. That's where my three files are there. So I've got the GSM, so I've copied the Maguro version and install this. And this will install the ROM Paranoid Android ROM. Um, it's pretty good. I think it's great hybrid mode um, ROM for your Galaxy Nexus. Uh, sort of gives you, you know, the best, best, the best of both worlds. And this latest version is really cool because it um, comes with um, customizable DPI for each app, um, which makes it, uh, which makes it really cool. I'll go into it um, when I review this. But I just want to show you installation because um, this one is there's a lot of files, so I don't want to get confused. Go uh, once that's done. Go to choose zip from SD card. Um, go back to the folder and install the fix. So here we go. Paranoid. Uh, there you go. Fix there. The one ends in fix two. Alright, and that's done. And then install Google Apps and reboot. That's pretty much it. Um, paranoid. And make sure you install the Google Apps provided here um, because this is a hybrid version, so you need a, I think you need this version. Don't install the universal version. So that's done. 
Um, we're going to reboot and uh, we should be... Oh, that's not done. It's taking, it's taking a little while. Okay, go back. Um, reboot system now. Hit the power button. And that's it. Um, that should be it. If you have any trouble, what you can do is go back into uh, the recovery again and do a dolly cache and clear cache. Um, that fixes most uh, boot loop problems or force closes or you, you have Google Play Store but you get force closes. Just do that and reboot and it should work. And that's the uh, boot animation. Looks really cool. Um, so I'm just going to show you that it's booted up and then you can do it yourself. That's pretty much it I think. But I really like this ROM. It kind of brings out a lot of extra features you can't get with stock ROM. Obviously, the main feature being that uh, hybrid tablet phone mode. Um, it's like a phablet uh, OS for your Galaxy Nexus. Um, and I think this this ROM is hot now because um, I have a lot of people telling me they love this ROM. Um, so this is also the ROM of the week. Um, I have two ROM of the week. This one and the the updated gummy gummy uh, ICS ROM version 1.2 so there you go um, so that's how you install it I'll just show you tease you with the um, the screen here and then I think that's it and that's how you install it um, I'll have a review of this ROM soon and uh, if you have a Galaxy Nexus um, GSM CDMA Sprint don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxynexusroot.com uh, we update you once or twice a week with ROM of the week tips hacks and more um, and it's a great way for you to com communicate with me via email and I don't share your email with anyone else but my dog and uh, if you're on YouTube please hit that like button for me there um, subscribe to my channel if you have um, and also you can subscribe to my main channel at Zetomax, that would be great. Um, and share this with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, or Google+, there's a button there. And uh, thanks you guys for watching my um, YouTube channel. And I'll have more cool stuff coming, and uh, stay high on Android, folks. See y'all later.